Dear Diary, I honestly don't know where to begin. My life is sort of a mess right now, even more so in the past few days. I'm extremely scared of the near, the near future. Tomorrow, actually. But I should probably start from the beginning, huh? Well, um, okay. Here we go. That's my dad. I know, right? Everyone calls him Lord Capulet. I mean, how obnoxious is that? So what, he made a few good business investments? It's not like he cured cancer or something that actually matters. You invite all the people on this list and no one else. Yes. And you, player 20 of the very best chefs. You won't be getting any bad chefs for me, so I'll make their liquor. I'll make their liquor in this. What does that even mean? <laughs> this is why I don't talk to the help. Lord, can't anyone get any better out here? Can I really go surprise? Yes, sir. Nan, I can never say Fernanda, her real name, when I was younger, and Nan just stuck. That calls me cause her nurse. But she's more than that. She practically raised me. Not that either of my parents were. She sure seemed happy when she came home today. That's me, Juliet Capulet, black sheep of the Capulet family. Why? Because because I prefer books over Hi. Um, so I went to fire, fire um, sale and he Well, isn't that great? Give Paris a call. This wedding's happening tomorrow. Oh, mother. First lady of the big man himself. Or gold head digger, like I would say. Wedding is happening tomorrow. Hey, Dan, can I be left alone right now? There's um, a lot for me to pray about. Sweetie, do you need my help? Are you busy? I'm, I'm fine, thank you. Um, both of you, go take care of the wedding right now. There's okay. Okay, don't be up too late. Remember, get your beauty sleep. <sighs> okay, finally, I can talk without being interrupted. So, the marriage, or marriage is really... I married Romeo, which is the problem because he's a Montague, which means he's he's my rival now. The thing is, though, he's really not bad. As a matter of fact, he's amazing. I'm supposed to marry Paris, this rich, pretty boy from across town, tomorrow. So I met with Friar, and he gave me this. He says it will make me appear dead. Morbid, huh? Anyway, after I'm married, he and my lovely Romeo will come and retrieve me, where we will then hopefully live happily ever after. Sounds like a plan, right? Not. I mean, think of all the things I can do. What if you wake up in the morning? Then what? Be reasonable, Juliet. Don't, Don't listen to her. We love him, Jay. Doesn't that mean anything? Okay, let's say it does work, like forever. Wake up. What would Dad do if he found out Fire orchestrated this whole charade? He obviously just wants you dead. Possible. He's a good man, and he wants the best for Verona. Think this marriage will resolve the feud and end all this drama? Come on. Ugh. What about waking up in the tomb? It'll be dark and cold, and what about Tybalt, huh? His corpse will be right there next to you, for God's sake. You'll go crazy. Remember in all those ghost stories? You're such an idiot. Like, I can't even. Yeah, I'm yeah. 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 yeah.